In this video, we'll simplify this fraction consisting of multiple trick ratios in different quadrants. And we will make use of a cost diagram in order to help us simplify this fraction. First, we'll start off with cos of 180 degrees plus theta. And we know that places us in the third quadrant and that cosine would produce a negative value in the third quadrant. So our first trick ratio would reduce to negative cos of theta. Next, we have tan of 360 minus theta. That is in the fourth quadrant and tan is negative in the fourth quadrant. So it will be reduced to negative tan of theta. In the denominator, we have sine of 90 minus theta. That is somewhere in the first quadrant. But we also know that 90 minus theta represents a co-function. So sine would change into cosine. And lastly, we have tan of 180 degrees minus theta, which is in the second quadrant. The tangent is negative in the second quadrant. So it will reduce to negative tan of theta. Notice that for all the reductions, we use brackets to show our changes. Otherwise, we can easily write it as negative cos minus tan theta in the denominator, where we ignore the multiplication of these terms. So it's better to use brackets to help us avoid unnecessary mistakes. We can also see we have negative tan theta divided by negative tan theta. So those terms will cancel out. We also have cos theta divided by cos theta. So that would simplify to an answer of negative 1.